is B. Today, we are going to learn about dinosaurs. Some of the most fascinating creatures that ever lived on planet Earth. Are you ready to start this adventure with me? Yes! yes? Let's go! Oh, wow! This looks like a dino habitat. Wow, this is so amazing! Our imagination is so amazing. It can take us back millions of years in the Mesozoic era. Yes, that's the time when dinosaurs roamed around the Earth. Dinosaurs were a group of reptiles that lived on planet Earth millions of years ago. They lived during a period known as Mesozoic Era or the Age of Dinosaurs, which lasted from 252 to 66 million years ago. How fascinating! We know that dinosaurs lived on our planet long time ago. But how long ago was it? Hmm. It was so long that us humans didn't even exist on planet Earth. There were many different types of dinosaurs, ranging from small and fast to huge and slow dinosaurs. Some of the most well-known types of dinosaurs include Tyrannosaurus rex, T-Rex, Stegosaurus, Triceratops, and Velociraptor, known as well as Raptor. Okay, friends, stay close and stick together because we're heading back in time at the age of dinosaurs where we're going to meet one of the most dangerous predators of all time, T-Rex. Tyrannosaurus rex roamed the planet about 65 millions of years ago in what is now the United States and Canada. Tyrannosaurus rex name comes from Greek and Latin and it means the Tyrant Lizard King. Tyrannosaurus rex was as long as a fire truck, including the ladder, and that's about 40 feet. Wow, that's pretty long, isn't it? Tyrannosaurus rex had about 50 to 60 banana-sized teeth in its mouth. That's a lot of teeth. Its jaw was so powerful, and this T-Rex was one of the most dangerous predators on Earth, and of course a carnivore, which means T-Rex ate meat. There were other dinosaurs that ate plants, and they are known as herbivores. T-Rex was a very smart dinosaur too. Its brain was twice as big as those of other giant carnivores. More than 20 T-Rex skeletons have been found in the United States, precisely in South Dakota. Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus lived about 150 million years ago. The stegosaurus brain was about the size of a walnut. <laughs> That's a pretty small brain, isn't it? Stegosaurus were herbivores too. This means that they ate plants and they roamed around Earth all four legs. Stegosaurus did not have very many teeth. These 
these dinosaurs are known for the rows of the big bony plates sitting along on their back. The first fossil of stegosaurus was discovered in 1877 in the state of Colorado. As a result, the U.S. state of Colorado has named stegosaurus as the state dinosaur of Colorado. Scientists believe that stegosaurus was a very small dinosaur and it had to use its tail and tail spine to defend itself from predators. The bony plates on its back, it's believed to help stegosaurus regulate the temperature of its body. And some other scientists believe that stegosaurus used the bony plates again to defend itself from predators. The bony plates would reach about three feet in height. That's very long actually for a bony plate. How amazing. The stegosaurus and Tyrannosaurus rex did not live on the same time periods. In fact, Stegosaurus lived way before T-Rex. Stegosaurus was also a long dinosaur. It reached about 30 feet long, which is approximately the size of a school bus. Wow! Third most well-known dinosaur is Triceratops. Triceratops name as well comes from Greek. Tri meaning three and ceratops or keratops meaning horned face. Three horned face. Triceratops had three horns in its face to protect itself from predators such as Tyrannosaurus rex that lived during the same time period. The length of a triceratop was about 25 to 30 feet long, and that's roughly as long as a mid-sized school bus. Triceratops also walked in four legs. The triceratops is one of the most easily recognizable dinosaurs because of its large body, unique frill, and the three horns. The last on the most popular dinosaur list is Velociraptor. Velociraptor is a small, speedy dinosaur and a very skillful hunter. Velociraptor is otherwise known as Raptor. Velociraptor was about 6.8 feet long and was a carnivore, which means Velociraptor or Raptor ate meat. Velociraptors were considered to be dinosaurs with brains larger in size when compared to species of the same size, which hints at a superior intelligence. They were probably a bit smarter than rabbits, but not quite as smart as cats and dogs. There is actually evidence that velociraptors move together, indicating group hunting, which requires intelligence to hunt in packs. Velociraptor or raptor was actually covered in feathers. But this dinosaur could not fly because its arms were too short. Hey friends, come closer because it's dino story time. Are you ready? Let's start. Once upon a time, in a land filled with prehistoric creatures, there were two best friends, a triceratops named Trix 
and a stegosaurus named Stegispike. Trix was known for his three horns on his face and his strong, sturdy build. On the other hand, Stegispike was known for her bony plates on her back and her long, spiky tail. Despite their physical differences, Trix and Stegispike were inseparable. One day, as they were gazing on some vegetation, they heard a loud roar in the distance. They both got so scared because they knew it was a Tyrannosaurus Rex, a fierce predator who loved to hunt down herbivores just like them. Trix and Stegispike immediately fled, running as fast and as far as they could to avoid being eaten. Finally, they reached the cliff and had nowhere else to go. The T-Rex was getting closer and closer, and Trix and Stegispike knew that they were in trouble. But just as the T-Rex was about to pounce, a flock of Pterodactylus flew overhead and started swooping down at the T-Rex, distracting him and giving Trix and Stegispike a chance to escape. From that day on, Trix and Stegispike realized that they could always count on each other no matter what. They went on many more adventures together, facing all kinds of challenges. But they always stuck together and never gave up. And so, Trix and Stegispike lived happily ever after, proving that true friendship can conquer even the scariest predators. I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for part 2 Dinosaur World and don't forget to subscribe. See you on the next episode. Bye bye!